I'm back, you whores. I asked you guys on Twitter and on Instagram if I should do like a series of Christmas looks and the ones that did vote, the majority was yes. So, I'm here. I might seem a little much for like a Christmas holiday look, but I went with red and gold and glitter. You know, tried to put in a little of everything in there. If you want to see how I did it, then keep on watching. See me again. Um, you're not gonna get the best view. I can't zoom in to my eyes, but I'll try to like do that when I'm editing. <sighs> I just changed my whole setting. I know I'm behind this wall. It looks better to be honest. I don't know why I didn't do this before. I don't know what I want to do yet for my look. Okay, I know what I'm gonna do. So. I prime my eyes with Maybelline Master Conceal, the little concealer. Um, I don't set my eyelids or nothing. I don't put any translucent powder. I don't put any type of powder. I just leave it wet base so that the pigment stays on. If you want to set your eyelids, you can. Do whatever you want. Doing one eye at a time so that it doesn't dry out. I'm gonna get a regular fluffy brush. I have a Morphe brush. I don't know... It was a holiday collection, so it doesn't have a number on it. I'm so sorry. Something like that. I'm going to dip into Modern Renaissance. I'm going to take Red Ochre. I'm going to pack it on. So I'm just going to take some and literally just pack it on. I'm going to start off with the red in the inner corner. <laughs> I'm going to do it up to like the inner corner to like the middle right there. Because what I want to do is red and then like a darker red and like a brown. So it's going to be like red to brown. Yeah. You'll see. And then once you pack it on, just blend out the outer edges. I'm using the same brush to blend it out. This video is probably not going to be funny because, you know, you guys wanted some fucking makeup look. So it should look something like that. I would pack on more color once you blend it away in the areas that you want depth because I want depth in the crease. So I'm just gonna keep packing on after I blend. I'm trying to keep it low, like I don't want it to blend up to my eyebrow. So when I'm blending, I'm very careful about that. I always do my eyes first, so this is weird for me. That's why I'm baking underneath because I don't want fallout. But if you do your face makeup first before your eyes, then this is the perfect tutorial for you. I don't even know if I should call this a tutorial because... I don't know. I'm not that professional, but... We can go with that. I'm using the same brush because... Because I'm not bougie. I'm gonna use the Soft Glam palette. And I'm gonna dip into Mulberry. It's like a red, but it's much darker than this. It looks like um. Kind of looks like a brick red. And I'm going to pack on the outer corner now. I'm going to start in the center where the red would meet. You might not see a difference when I'm packing it on. Because they're both red. But I'm going to darken the outer corner after that. It looks like the same color. You can kind of tell it's like red to brown. I'm doing the same thing. I'm just blending it out. Once I pack it on... Trying to keep it low. I'm gonna wing it out. I know it looks crazy right now, like, I know, I'm aware. But in the end, it's not gonna look that crazy. I'm gonna take another brush that I have. It's another Morphe brush. Again, it's the same collection, so I don't know what number, but a little more dense and smaller, and I'm gonna blend out the top a little more. Should look something like this, just blended. I'm gonna take I'm gonna take the same little dense brush and I'm gonna get Cypress Umber, the brown color in the Modern Renaissance palette, and I'm gonna darken out that the the outer V. Okay, I don't know if 
you can tell, but it's way dark over here on this outer corner. Now, we're gonna cut the crease. And I'm gonna use the same concealer to cut it. I'm gonna use this Morphe brush. It's a little... It's a little angled brush. I started with a little bit of concealer on the brush, but just enough that's coated like around it too, like that. So that when I do it, it's like precise lines. Don't breathe for this part. <laughs> I'm going for something like that. You don't have to do that. You can literally just do a half cut crease and call it a day, but I want to be extra. All right, so something like that. I'm gonna like blend out the concealer like towards this area right here. Just kind of blend it out so that it's not super harsh and make it as precise as you possibly can from the soft glam palette i'm gonna put the color bronze that one towards the middle and the end a tip for putting color and like a shimmer just do it with your finger look at the difference with my finger so instead of just this shimmer because it's boring and it's not it's not enough i'm gonna get this nyx glitter just says nyx professional makeup but I got it at CVS. It's like a trio thing. No, where did I get it? No, I got this at Kohl's. Same thing with this. I think it came in a pack. It brought this, I'm pretty sure. And this is the NYX Glitter Primer. I'm just using a small brush to pack it on. The shimmer on the bottom kind of set like a nice base for the glitter. Now, we're gonna use a pigment. I'm taking a more precise smaller brush, something like that. Okay, I put my lashes on and stuff. Now I'm gonna do the bottom, the lower lashes. I'm gonna get red ochre and I'm just gonna pack it on the bottom. Take one of the brushes that comes in the Anastasia palettes and I'm gonna use the smaller. Oh, this has stuff on it. <laughs> the smaller end of the brush. That one. And I'm gonna buff this out. I like to blow out the bottom like a lot, like my bottom eyeshadow. I really like to smoke it out. I'm taking. L'Oreal Telescopic Mascara. This is honestly such a good mascara for the price and for a drugstore mascara. A piece just fell out. Fuck. 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 Too much blush, but it looks good in person. I use airspun to bake under my eyes and my nose for my contour. Now we're gonna highlight. 